Welcome back to the only hour of truth in your entire little life. The Nocturnal Manifesto with Dr. Jonah. You know, kittens, I was flying Glory Bird, my beautiful Cessna 172 Skyhawk, out here the other day, out to the desert to bring you the words of the truth. And I got to thinking I was up there among the clouds and flying above it all. And you look down and everything looks so peaceful, so serene, so in order, but it's not. It's not in order, my friends. It is not the place you think it is. People ask me about the media all the time, the conservative media, the liberal media. There's no such thing, kittens, no such thing at all. There's only the Saturnians and the media. They run it. They run it all from top to bottom. They play us like fine fiddles, like a Stradivarius from another world. And here we are, listening to what the words are said. Doesn't matter what side you're on. You're on their side, I'm on the other side. There's no sides, kittens, there's no sides. It's a sphere, a sphere of influence we have no control over. We live inside the sphere and we don't see the outside. It's painted a beautiful color blue, it looks like the sky, but it is not the sky. It's not real. They're out there, holding us in this sphere. They don't want us out. We're happy little birds in a cage. We're like the majestic lion that they throw a stake to, and we think we've got it made. But there's glass all around us, kittens. There's walls all around us. There's moats all around us, and we can't get over them because we don't even know they're there. How do you escape a cage when you don't even know you're in one? That's the question that is echoing through my mind as I'm flying Glory Bird over the wonderful southwestern desert where truth comes to me because I'm free from the shackles of the ground and I look into the sky and I can see the sphere. I see it, kittens, and I'm bringing it to you all the time. I talk about the sphere of influence that we have no control over. I talk about these cages that you cannot see in my new book, The Myth of Freedom. It's available at your fine local bookstore. You know, people have asked me if I can download it to their Kindles or other unsecure devices, and I will always say no to that because everything that's online has been seen, has been changed, has been corrupted by the powers that be. Do not trust what you see on the internet, kittens. They are watching. Sometimes people ask me, Dr. Jonah, why don't you have a TV show? Don't you think you could reach more people? Well, kittens, have you ever heard of a man named Vladimir Karamazov? Of course you haven't, because they don't want you to. He was a scientist for the Kremlin in the 1950s. He discovered a way to modify the cathode ray projector in TVs to send subliminal signals, to plant ideas and suggestions directly into your brain. Now, the fact that he was Russian doesn't matter. It wasn't the Russians versus the U.S. It wasn't the French versus the Spanish. It wasn't the Mexicans versus the Hondurans. It doesn't matter who they are. You gotta understand, those are just words. Those are just boundaries on a map that doesn't even exist. What matters is that he was working in a secret lab in Vladivostok until 1973, when he was kidnapped by a certain agency that shall remain nameless. He continued his work at a secret lab in Topeka, Kansas, hidden in plain sight in a strip mall. And although TV technology has changed throughout the years, LEDs and plasma screens, his work and his blueprints have been adapted to every major television producer in the world. And guess what, kittens? That phone that you're holding in your hands every hour of every day like the blind followers that you are, when you look into that phone, the phone is looking back. You know, this scotch is really good, but you know what? Every now and then, I need a good beer. I need a good smooth glass of old gold beer. Because this portion of our show is brought to you by the fine people of old gold beer. If you want the truth, kittens, old gold will show you the truth about good beer. You're an American original, my friend. 
You don't want anything that tastes half-ass, especially your beer. You want the American flavor? Do you want some foreign beer ballet dancing around your taste buds? <laughs> I don't think so. You want the American flavor? You want the American flavor. Old Gold Beer. Taste the pride. Don't forget to look for Dr. Jonah's Bunker Dogs. Hot dogs made to last through the Armageddon. They're available in nacho, spicy chipotle, and new Cool Ranch flavors. We use only natural preservatives guaranteed to give the Bunker Dogs a shelf life of over 25 years. So when we all move underground to escape who and what is coming, we can count on Bunker Dogs to make the time there tasty. They're made with 100% beef and no mind-controlling antibiotic steroids like all the other brands. Bunker Dogs, they're apocalyptic. I always have to laugh when I hear people talk about the government. People on the left, people on the right, people conservative, people liberal, Democrat, Republican, doesn't matter. You don't understand. Up, down, top, left, right, bottom, inside, outside. They're all the same kittens. It doesn't matter. The government plays us all. They play us back and forth. Keep the people occupied. What do you think the Colosseum was about? What do you think Gladiators was about? What do you think the World Wrestling Federation is about? What do you think the Kardashians are about? The government wants to take away your freedoms, the so-called freedoms. That also makes me laugh. I love it when people say that. The government's going to take away my freedoms. You never had any freedoms, kittens. You never had them. Their construct, your vision of what freedom is, has nothing to do with freedom. It's like a prisoner has been in a dark cell all his life, so they cut a small window and they let in a shaft of light, and he thinks his life is better. Well, kittens, I'm here to tell you I am not that shaft of light. I am the light itself. I will show you the way. I will show you what real freedom is. The problem with all of these things is sometimes they're silly. Sometimes they take them out of context. Sometimes they make you think Bigfoot is real. Bigfoot's not real. You know what was real? Atlantis was real. Atlantis was real, kittens. It wasn't destroyed by a volcano. It wasn't destroyed by an earthquake. It was destroyed by the Saturnians because they were close to finding the truth. The rich. You know who's rich? Not who you think they are. You make a good living, that's fine. You're super rich, eh, maybe. But you know what? There's 1% of the people out there who have 95% of everything we own and we don't even realize it. That's it. That's the world now. And they love it. They are so happy about it. They finally found how they can keep us all happy. All we gotta do is play a new game. This part of the show is brought to you by Dr. Jonas Sunscreen. It's free from the chemical poisons they put in all the other brands that affect your mind's ability to discern the real from the imagined. It's not about the sun, kittens. It's about what's in your brains. It's also SPF 50, but more importantly, it's GPP 75. Government Propaganda Protection. GPP protects you and me. Look, well, kittens, it's that time again on the Nocturnal Manifesto of Dr. Jonah. It is time for you to speak truth to me. I spend my time doing all I can to open up your eyes, but it's your turn to reach out and talk to me your truth. So call us over here at the Nocturnal Studios. You know the number. Give us a call and we'll put you on the air. Looks like we have a caller on the line. Steve from Pasadena, speak to me your truth. Hi, is this Dr. Jonah? Hey, thanks. Look, thanks for having me on, first of all, but I gotta... I went on your website, and I'd like to know what all this stuff about Beverly Summerwine is. You know, you're making a lot of claims about her, and I, I don't get it. I hear you, Steve, from Pasadena. I really do. But I hear the truth beneath your words, the truth that you yourself don't even hear. You know what? You don't even realize how much of a tool you are of the power elite. You bring up something like Beverly Summerwine, and you think you know what you're talking about. Do you know why I say what I say about Beverly Summerwine? Because Beverly Summerwine is the tip of the iceberg. I personally don't understand why someone in your position, you're doing good, you're on the radio, why you got to make up stuff about people like this that you know jack squat about. You better be careful out there, Steve, because it sounds to me 
Like you don't really know what's going on. Like maybe, maybe you're getting an inkling of what's going on. Maybe you're peering behind the shadows just a little bit, pulling that veneer away from the darkness of your eyes and you're starting to see some light, but what you see is shadows, my friend. You just see the shadows on the wall. Oh, that's a bunch of horse hockey. Where'd you get that? There's a wind coming, Steve, from Pasadena. It is coming, and it is blowing across the land, starting off as a small breeze building itself up into a typhoon of truth, and it will blow the lid off of everything you know. Well, you, 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 know absolute, you know absolutely zero about this woman, and you're making all kinds of false things about her, and I don't know why that would be. Dr. Jonas is close. He is very, very close, and there's so much I can't say yet, kittens. There is so much I want to say, but the time isn't quite right yet. Still gathering my forces, still gathering my information, but it is there, and it is ready to go, and it will be told. What do you know? You may think you know Beverly. Maybe you had contact with Beverly Steve from Pasadena, if that's your real name, which I'm almost 100% sure is not the case, but Steve... Beverly is not who she seems to be. She is a puppet of the power elite. And you are probably in very deep danger. Okay, well, now I'm basically confused. And so the truth is coming, kittens. It is coming like a hurricane across the land. The wind will blow us all clean. It will clear the cobwebs from our eyes. It will clear the mist from our brains. And it will free us all. The wind will free us all. And you know what else is the truth, kittens? This is the truth. Here is the truth, kittens. Nothing beats a plump, juicy bunker dog on a Sunday afternoon. You know, this hour of the Nocturnal Manifesto with Dr. Jonah is brought to you by the fine folks of Bunker Dogs. They're made with 100% beef and no mind-controlling antibiotic steroids like all the other brands. Bunker Dogs, they're apocalicious.